Okay, so um, Len's asked me to provide an update really, firstly on the role of the COVID physician in our local health district. As you've heard, we have no cases of COVID in hospital at the moment, but the role is still a really important one because the screening for COVID includes anybody with a fever or anybody with respiratory symptoms that can't be explained. And part of the very important role of this with public health is to make sure that we don't miss anybody. And as you've seen in other places in Sydney, if you miss one poor person with COVID, it can actually influence a lot of other people. And so we have a, a great service where once the four respiratory physicians and our infectious diseases physician for a week, we actually do the role 24 seven, literally. And we um, take calls from anywhere from Tokemole to Finlay, to Berrigan, to Griffith, to Hay, to obviously being based in Wagga. We provide phone advice to all the GPs. We provide phone advice to the nurses. We help with who should be swabbed. We help with who needs to come in. I currently have about 50 15 patients in hospital at the moment, not with COVID, but under the COVID precautions, as we say, because to keep our community safe, we actually presume somebody is positive once they're swabbed until we prove they're negative, while of course treating the other illnesses that they happen to have. And I think that service is actually unique, speaking to my colleagues in Sydney. I don't think any other hospital in New South Wales has that centralised respiratory physician dedicated for the week to just look after the COVID service. And I think that's one of the strengths of our system and local health districts and I also think it's part of the reason why our cases are also so low because we're having such a low threshold to screen them and I think that's really keeping the community safe. I'd also, I commend the community as well as Len did but I also commend my patients because my patients come in and we feel they probably don't have COVID. They're in a room with people wearing gowns for the you know 48 hours it takes to clear them. Not one person has complained, not one patient has been concerned about you know limitation of visitors. They all very much are dedicated to their communities and keeping them safe and as always I'm very humbled by, by amazing patients who really do take that on board so I think I'm happy to take questions on the role.